Can I do a FOIA request? A what? Request? Public Information Act. Do you want a records request? Records request, yep. They said it's online on the city website. Oh, I can do it in person too. Oh, you want to talk to him? Mm -hmm. want, want to do a records request? Okay, if you go to the city of Aza website, go into yeah. the city secretary and you can go through there. Yeah, I wanted to do it in person. We don't do them in person. We, that's the way we can keep track of them. Oh, can I get your name and title? I'm Michelle and that's all you need to know. Okay. According to the Attorney General, I'm allowed to do it in person. Well, things have changed a little bit, and that is not true. Our city requires that you do it through the City of Aza website. Okay. And your name was, again? Michelle. Michelle. Mm -hmm. And your position here? I'm records manager. You're the records manager, and you're telling me this? I am telling you that. Wow. And so, you're refusing to take my records request. I'm not refusing. I'm telling you how to do it. Yes, you There's can do difference. it. I can be happy to look up the statute for you. I already know the statute. No, ma'am, you don't. You're okay. mistaken. Can you look it up real quick? Oh, Michelle, Michelle, Michelle. Yeah, agreed. That is not right. Excuse me, Michelle? Michelle? Give just a second. So, oh, so I can do it in person. I printed it offline for you. All right. And who is your supervisor, Michelle? Lieutenant Rogers. Lieutenant Rogers. Is Lieutenant Rogers available? I'm not sure if he's here. Okay. But I'll check. Can you find out for me? And. Yeah. Okay. Okay, cool. And I'll be done with this here in just a few minutes to give it back to you. So we are requesting record clerk Michelle, last name, salary, and dates of employment. She's still in the corner. Michelle, I'm done with it. Okay. If I could get a time stamp stamped Sorry? copy. Can I get a time stamped copy, please? How's it going? It's going right by meeting with you. I guess so. My name's Chris. Jordan McCord. Jordan, nice to meet you, brother. So, I was just dealing with Michelle, records clerk. Yes, sir. Uh, she refused to give me her last name, but she was very rude, and she gave me a lot of misinformation on the um, Public Information Act. Okay. So, I was asking to do it in person, and initially she refused, told me flat out, no, you have to do it online, which you can do it in writing according to the Attorney General. Okay. And so I've You're now doing like a records request. Correct. Okay. And you don't have to do that online. And the reason that the attorney general has that statute listed is because home, a lot of homeless people don't have access to online. Okay. And so you can come in person and do a records request. And that's all I was asking to do. And she got, and you can watch my video later down the road. She just, was just very rude about it. Okay. And, is there a particular uh, incident or record that you're trying to get a hold of that I can help you with? And or? so, well, I just gave it to her. She's supposed to be giving me a timestamp copy back. She's finally now taking it from yeah. me, but I, I shouldn't. I think it's something like 10 days from the yeah, time of it's request that ten, she can ten, bu it. 10 business days. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not asking for information right now. I just wanted to fill out the form, give uh -huh. it to her, and get a copy. And she refused to do that initially. A copy of the form? copy of the form that I filled out, Correct. A timestamp copy showing that I submitted a records oh, request. Oh, okay. I got you. Yeah. Um, not asking for information right now. That's okay. Un, you know, that's not respectable or reasonable. Well, what's the, and so my what's complaint the is, request for? Um, the request is now for Michelle's last name, her okay. salary, and dates of employment. Okay. 
Well, I can I can tell you that her her name is Michelle Abramsky. She's our only records clerk. That's, okay, uh, she's the only one that works here. But um, how do you spell Abram? Uh, <laughs> right. I, I just know that it's Abramsky. Does she have a business card that you could get for me? Is that I don't think she has doable? printed business cards. Okay. We have generics that we use. I know, um, I know. that stuff's written on. But um, can I get one of your generics and get her last name written on there? Yeah. Let me. Uh, Thank you, ma'am. Is that what you're looking for? So, yeah, she's handling it now, but I still want to go ahead and get her last name because I may end up on a follow up formal complaint after I read policies and procedures for the city here. L let me get you one of those cards. I'm sorry, I don't have any in my pocket yeah. right now. Dude, uh, I, I get it. Right in the middle of the test back there. I'm sorry. No worries. Okay. Sorry, we're right in the middle of it. No, I'm okay. I'm always narrating. I got to talk right. to the people. <laughs> uh, so I wanted to get you my card. That's my shield. Uh, okay. My first name is Jordan. I'll write it on there if you want it. And um, so on the back, uh, I've got her name. Okay. What they were telling me is that if it's a request for a specific salary schedule, mm -hmm. I think some of it's online. I think you can pretty much get all the title positions for our salary schedule with the city okay. off the website. I don't know how to navigate to it exactly, but if you want to do a specific request for one position, they said it would just be like a records request like that. Yeah. So just did it. the salary schedule would be given to you for that specific person. Yeah. But honestly, I think you can find it online if you want to do that. But here's but, my yeah. card. No, just like you said, you don't know how to navigate to it. Neither do I. Yeah. Yeah. So, I fill this out. It gets yeah. emailed to me. I don't got to go find it. Right. right. So, I, I spend way too much time reading Chapter 552 and learning these laws. So, Well, the phone number for the PD is on there. I've also got my uh, work cell phone on there. Okay. That's this second number. Gotcha. Um, I keep that on me when I'm here at work, not when I'm not. So, if you call that know. and I'm not at work, if you leave a voicemail, I'll call you on my next day. In. Work sale, man. I wouldn't take it home. Okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> no, if it's an emergency, they'll right? call my personal. But when you're off duty, you're off duty, man. Right. Put your feet up, you know, watch football games. Well, technically, we're not off duty we're, when we're I, off duty. We're yeah, still subject I, to call any time. So. I know. You are subject to call, yeah. and if you see a felony, you got to jump in. There's and, no such thing as real off duty, but. Yeah, you know, it's. Is there anything else I can help no, you No, that's it, brother. That's it. So, is you that know. everything that you wanted? Yep, I'll get that from okay. her. Yep, holler at we'll me anytime. Nice meeting you. Yeah, nice meeting you, brother. What was your name again? Chris. Chris, nice to meet you. is her name the records clerk Abram Abramsky so guys I'm here at Azel PD and I want y'all to remember especially you officers that are watching abused by your partner not in my county we prosecute remember that guys we prosecute so I'm Chris against tyranny guys and until next time, we the people are pissed off.